Hello, hello everybody. It is Galaxy Bat One coming to you July 5th for the weekly atomic shop um, update and the reset the weekly challenges. So let's head on in and check this out. Sorry I missed last week because I was sick, so I wasn't able to get on, but doing better this week. So let's head on in real quick and check it out. We have the Cultist Dungeon Bundle. You're going to get the outfit and headwear, uh, Warglaive paint, um, the Steel Dip Skull Torch, Radiation Test Dummy, um, the Skeletal Ceiling Light, and the Head in a Jar. So some of this is actually pretty cool. I like that light though, that's nice. I also like the head in the jar. Welcome back, number two. So you're going to get the Voltic Cuckoo Clock. The Blackbird Power Armor Paint Set. Contemporary Housing Kit. And the Camouflage Hunting Rifle Paint. Here's where, what the Cultist Dungeon outfit looks like. I actually kind of like this outfit. It's really creepy looking. Here's the Wardglaive. The skull torches. Oh, I like that. That's cool. Radiation dummy. Test dummy. The ceiling light. Oh, yes. And it does the flame out of the hands. I like it. Definitely. That's going to be one thing I'm going to get. So everything from last week is still available. I haven't checked it out yet. So you get the Flaming Skulls bundle, which is the Power Armor skin and the Skull Drum set. Uh, fire Hazard backpack and the Fire Hazard paint for your flamer. Welcome back, number one. Still available from last week. Log Cabin Kit, Red Rocket Power, Connectors, Camouflage, Power Paint armor paint set uh what an inlaying for your uh lover action here's the skull rider excavator power armor skin the skull drum set fire hazard paint for your flamer uh the Pfizer fire hazard backpack And then the ghillie rifle paint and uh, backpack. And then the greatest hits, you can get the stash bundle. And it's going to come with the toy stash box, an ornate stash box, and the secret bookcase stash box. I really like this ornate one. I'm not a really big fan on the toy one, but I like the ornate one. Uh, park ranger bundle is up for grabs if you don't have it. So the lookout tower park ranger jumpsuit, which is really cute. I have the jumpsuit and it's really nice. Uh, power armor skin for your uh, park ranger power armor skin and the Explore a new world frame. On the back of it has like a little flower emblem thing on it. It's pretty nice. I like it. There's the ornate stash box, so that's probably going to be one thing that I get. Looks like you get like a bronze, maybe a silver option. Here's the toy stash box. The secret stash. Firewatch tower, if you don't have it. And you just want that. The ranger park, the park ranger jumpsuit. See, it has like flowers and stuff on it. I like it. That's really pretty. If you want just a power armor by itself. So this is going to go for your Excavator Raider T45, T51, T60, Ultrasight XL1. And then the Exploring Our New World Frame. Vaulting soon. Everything from a couple weeks back, which is the Plotting Table, Captain Cosmo uh, Power Armor Bundle, Slocum Joe's Paint Set, uh, the Captain Cosmo Power Armor, Quantum Bottle Lamp, Captain Cosmo Bed, and the Look to the Stars Wallpaper. And in specials for this week, you get a Tan Military at Free Supply Package. I'm going to go ahead and grab that so I don't forget. Red Menace Backpack. 
And then if you're Fallout first, you're going to get the Scanning Skull Torch for free. And these two down here, I believe the other two are going to be for Fallout first only. So if you don't have Fallout first and you can't see those, that would be why. Um, so you get the HRE Power Armor skin. And it can be applied to all Power Armors. And then of course their Garden Bundle comes with the Red Truck Trailer uh, with Junk. The Gardening Week Flag, Gardening Bounty Flag. Faded Gardening Flag, White Long Curtains, Pink Floater Mobile, and the Industrial Door. Metal Door, that's not a bad price for, well, yeah, well, my price isn't a bad price for what's left because I already own part of it. So that's it for the Atomic Shot this week. Let's head on over to the challenges real quick. Uh, complete one Gold Star Daily Challenge. Should level up three times. Build floor, wall, or roof in workshops or camps 25 times. Complete five daily operations, 10 events. Uh, complete the, the Mothman Equinox Daily Challenge five times. Drink 25 Nuka Colas. Kill 10 Glowing Creature. Uh, repair Power Arm... Armor, weapons, or power armor 10 times, and of course the repeatable XP game. So that's it for the Atomic Shop and the reset of the weekly challenges this week. Let me know what you think about them, and I will catch y'all next week. Bye!